Just because Cranked was taken out of the game doesn't mean I can't still show some gameplay. I still got some YouTube worthy clips saved up from Cranked that I could release at any time. I saw that guy run through the doorway. You can't hide from me. And look at him! He took time to stop and look at the picture on the wall. You don't got time to admire the artwork. This isn't a museum. You're playing some Call of Duty. Someone's got to inform this guy. Maybe he's a Christmas noob. You know, there aren't too many Christmas noobs in this game. I have ran into a couple, but... I don't know. I, I think the skill-based matchmaking in this game is too strong. You're not going to get any Christmas noobs. Crash. I'm just... I'm not a big fan of this map. I don't really have a great opening route. I usually have a pretty good opening route on other maps, but... This map, I, I try and just run under this arch. Ooh, I didn't finish that kill. And now I hear them behind me. Yeah. I just, I knew that was going to happen. You know? Maybe, I think I just need to try and push up. Go on the outside of the left. That's probably my best bet. Ooh. Look at this guy. Look at that guy. He just left the game before I could kill him. I was in the middle of shooting at him and he just left the game. The game only just started. He already had enough. Maybe he doesn't like Crash also. They did make a couple of adjustments on Crash. They have this new head glitch just to my right. And originally I wasn't a big fan of it. But as you can see, I just get a bunch of free kills. You can push up behind the blue building right here. Just get a bunch of free kills. And look at that. My teammate ran right through the front door. I said, okay. He's coming from there. I don't need to watch that direction. My teammate was just there, so I turn around. And what do you know, when the enemy comes right through and shoots me in the back. You can never trust teammates in this game. I, I don't know if matchmaking is, is just that bad that they even give you bad teammates. They make the game harder by matching you with tougher enemies and they give you bad teammates. I mean, I felt that way in other CODs as well, but... In this game, just, you can never expect your teammates to get a kill. Recently, I did update my MP5 class again. Mainly, it was from playing Shipment. I kind of wanted to put on the collapsible stock for more ADS speed and movement speed. Mostly just for Shipment, but I kind of liked it. I, I felt like the recoil on it was actually really manageable. I think when I tried it, you know, a couple months ago or weeks ago, however long ago when I last tried it, I just didn't like it that much. I'd, I'd rather have some recoil attachments and I didn't really mind the, the less ADS speed, but using it recently, I really enjoyed it. That's what I'm using in this game. Maybe I'll make some nice editing and I'll throw the, the picture of the class on the screen. Oh, look at these doors. Like... I mean, you try and run through a door and the enemy at the, tries to run through the door at the same time. That happens all the time. I, that kind of player uh, interaction is, is just terrible. They need to fix that. Just get rid of the doors. Or make it so that you don't bump into each other and the door being that physical object. Anyway, yeah, so I'm running this new class. I also went back to Specialist. I kind of got bored of running the UAV and the advanced UAV. I mean, everyone's running Ghost anyway. And the advanced UAV is pretty weak, so... I just went back to Specialist. I also am running Scavenger as my first perk. Not, I used to run EOD and I would have to run fully loaded, but... Again, for shipment, I don't need fully loaded, so... I'm pretty much running with my shipment class. So... I wanted to talk about Christmas. I know I touched on Christmas noobs, but I've been on break, and I don't know if you know. Recently, I've been I've been coaching on a uh, a ski team. I go skiing every weekend, and I'm on break for this week, so I'm up skiing all week, and I'm coaching a freestyle team. I used to be on the freestyle team as a as a kid. Now I'm just coaching it, but. It's, it's a lot of fun, but I've noticed recently that I, I'm just not as good 
as I was back when I was on the team. I mean, I haven't skied in a while, so that's probably expected, but I was trying to go through the park and, you know, I can land my threes, 360. If you're not a fan of skiing or you don't understand a lot of the freestyle terms, basically a 360 is like you go off a jump and you do one full spin and then a 720 would be two spins. So I'm, I can do a 360, no problem, 540, can do all of that easy. But when I try and spin and go up to a 720, for some reason, I just go off axis. Like, I, I just can't, I can't keep my body straight, and I'm not one to give up. So I've fallen a bunch, and I just, I keep trying. But today, I, I took it too far. Like I just, I kept falling, and hitting my left hip over and over and over again. And look at this. This guy's just sitting in the back of the map. I was on a nice specialist streak. He killed me in like two bullets. I think that was the Ram 7. I hate how they add in DLC. I guess it's not DLC. It's just like it's part of the uh, that season one pack. But I hate how they add in all these new weapons. And they become like the best weapons in the game. Like, I don't want them to be, like, a terrible weapon that nobody uses them, but I feel like it shouldn't instantly be, like, a go-to weapon because now anybody that doesn't have it needs to have it, and I, the best weapon in the game, like, the M4 was already killing so quickly. We don't need a gun that kills even faster, so... Yeah, but anyway, back to... Back to skiing. I was... I was... I just kept... Look at that. I'm gonna interrupt myself again. This isn't Black Ops 4. You see me try- I shot that kid and I shot punched him. Do you miss the shot punch in the game? I used to love being able to shoot punch in Black Ops 4. You could kill people really quickly. And look at this spawn. I just had nice another nice specialist streak. And the guy spawns right behind me. I thought I cleared out that whole side. I could run up the steps. Alright, anyway, back to, back to skiing. So, I just kept falling over and over again on my left hip and by the end of the day I couldn't even ski down the mountain like I I normally go pretty straight down the mountain I go really fast but I literally I literally had to go like five miles an hour down the mountain my whole left side is bruised up after I record this commentary I'm probably just gonna go to bed call it look at me, again trying to nice look at me I'm trying to punch somebody again I don't know what's gone into me but yeah I'm I'm so sore I've been trying to get the kids on the team they're anywhere from like 8 to 13 look at look at that throw i told you i'm the best semtex thrower in the game i stuck that kid up on the roof you just can't teach that that is next level so yeah the kids on the on the freestyle team they're anywhere from like 8 to 13 and recently i've been with uh, some of the older kids and they're they're actually really good they're good through the park a lot of them are spinning they do they re do really well on the rails and stuff and I've been trying to get them to to do tricks on the bigger jumps, but they've kind of they've been a little afraid of doing that. So to kind of like incentivize them to do it, I've been just hucking myself off these jumps, which I used to do all the time. Like I don't know why. I, mean, I get it. I haven't skied in a while, like I said, but I shouldn't be this bad right now. Like I'm a coach. I've got to be better. I got to be able to land all these tricks and. I've been failing. I just can't. I just can't land them. So I think I just gotta take it easy. I I probably should should be icing my side. Like I called my mom today. She told me I need to ice it. But I don't know. I, I think I I think I'm just gonna take it easy. Try and s see how it feels in the morning, and we'll 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 just deal with it that way. Hopefully it's. Look at that. Another knife. Another night. I can't believe. It. I don't think I've had more than a couple of shot punches in this entire game, and I've had like three or four in this game alone. That's pretty crazy. But yeah, I don't know. When I spin, as soon as I go off the jump, I kind of I just go off axis. So it's not that I can't. I I get the full spins around, but I'm like in the air and I'm just leaning way back, and it's crazy because when I'm doing it, I don't even notice that I'm off axis. Like. It feels perfectly normal to me, but everyone else says I'm way off axis, and then I come down, and I'm I'm not standing up, and I fall, and I just I keep doing it the same thing over and over again. And I know what I'm doing wrong, but I can't fix it. So 
Yeah, so I, I'm going to keep skiing the rest of the week. Hopefully, I'll be okay. This was a, a good crash game here. 43 and what I go? 43 and 6. Yeah, pretty good. 